guys, what's up? It's Winnie here. Today I'm gonna be swatching the new Maybelline Color Sensational lipsticks. They came out with some new matte shades, which I was so excited about because these are some of my favorite drugstore lipsticks. And in my last drugstore makeup haul video, you guys asked to see these swatched. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch all nine shades. And like I mentioned in that video, these shades are all kind of a nudie, pink, mauve rosy color family, which I really like. I have tons of lipsticks that kind of look similar, but it's the color that I gravitate towards I think it complements my skin tone the best so it's what I like but if you guys want to see how these colors look on keep watching okay I have wiped off the chapstick that I had on my lips because my lips are like dry AF right now so if the lipsticks look really dry on my lips it's because my lips are actually really dry so the first shade is hot sand again this is the lightest shade and it looks kind of like a warm nude beige I'm not sure how this is gonna look on my lips my lips naturally are a little bit more more pigmented so here is hot sand and the color is definitely saturated and it is also a very white based nude so you can see it completely covered my natural lip color but it's just that this lipstick is so pale I don't really think it suits me and again, please excuse my dry lips, but the formula of the lipstick, like I said, is very creamy and it was easy to apply. The next shade I have is in Purely Nude. This one looks like it's a slightly more blue-based pinky nude. Here is Purely Nude on the lips. Again, it's very, very light and I'm not sure it really goes with my complexion. It's a very, very pale nude, so I don't know if it's my cup of tea. I do have some concealer here because the more I try the colors and the more I remove them, my lips get a little bit more red so I don't want that to conflict with the actual shade next I have the shade peach buff which looks like a really pretty light pinky rose color so here is peach buff on the lips I do like this shade I think it's a really pretty soft pink and if I didn't mention these don't really have a scent or flavor or anything to them they don't really smell like anything at all and then I have honey pink which is a brighter more corally pink Here's Honey Pink on the lips. I actually really like this shade because I think it's a very fun and vibrant pink and it still works really well with yellow or olive skin tones. All right, so now we're getting into some of the deeper, rosy, mauve shades that I really like. And the next shade I have is Naked Coral. It looks like this. It's actually kind of close to my natural lip color, so I think I'm going to like this one. By the way, I've noticed that if your lips are not completely dry before you put on the lipstick, it can kind of apply splotchy, so I'm just kind of wiping off my lips. Here is Naked Coral on the lips. I really like this shade. I think it's super wearable. And the other thing I really like about this lipstick is you can go over it several times without this feeling really like cakey on the lips at all. Next up, I have Raw Chocolate, which looks like a really pretty warm nudie brown. And it sounds delicious and I just wanna bite it. I kind of overdrew my lips with this one, but this color is so pretty on. It reminds me of like a terracotta rose color. It is slightly more on the orangey side, but I don't really mind that because it makes it a very wearable nudie brown, and I think it's really pretty on. Okay, we're nearing the end now. This shade is Almond Rose. I cannot stop overdrawing my lips, but I will say with these darker shades, I think they are so much easier to apply. I feel like I just go over it really quickly and the color is beautiful. Whereas some of the lighter shades, like the first few shades that I swatched, I felt like I needed to go over a couple more times to make sure that my natural lips were covered. But this shade, can we just talk about how pretty this is? I think this might be one of my favorites. I think also because it really resembles the shade Pasadena from Ofra the liquid lipstick that I am obsessed with. I just love how the color looks so velvety smooth on your lips with that soft matte finish. Ooh, this one kind of stains the lips a little bit. You can see that it's like slightly more pink now, but I think you can remove it with a wet wipe. Okay, next is Toasted Truffle, which looks like a really pretty deep chocolate brown. Here's Toasted Truffle on the lips. And the last shade I have is Brown Blush, which kind of looks like a brown with a hint of like berry or like purple color in it. Okay, this is a very unique brown shade because like I said, it kind of has that like 
purpley pink in it, which makes it so pretty and it kind of matches the eyeshadows that I have on my eyes today, which I absolutely love. All right guys, so those are all of the new matte Maybelline Color Sensational lipsticks. I hope you enjoyed this swatch video. Let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite shade. And please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. That would help me out a lot. And don't forget to check out my links for my Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat that are all linked down below. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.